I was looking for things that give me information about the health of the woodland. One of the groups that sort of struck me as being important when I found out more about them are the moths. So there's about 150 species of butterflies in the entire state of Illinois, but as far as we know, uh, at the moment there's about 1,850 species of moths in the state. So it's a much larger group, much more diverse. Um, and moths can be divided into macro moths and micro moths. The micro moths are very, very tiny, uh, down to three or four millimeters long. Uh, in some cases, we can only identify moths by knowing what plant it eats. So it's a, it's a real close tie to the, the health of the community because if those plants aren't there, those moths aren't going to be there. Some moths are decomposers. They live in the litter layer and their caterpillars feed on the litter and uh, break up the, the leaf material, help to decompose it. The other important aspect of moths is just the food that they provide for other organisms. They're important pollinators. Even if you have a small yard, just planting one native plant, planting native vegetation someplace in your yard would be a positive thing to do for moths and invertebrates in general. To get more people interested in moths and being aware of the diversity of them. Uh, a group started this Moth Week uh, phenomenon just to develop the awareness of the importance of moths and the diversity of them. I've been doing this for two and a half years. Even with, with having identified 480 species so far, almost every day I go out there's something I haven't seen. There's just constantly more diversity uh, out there than you realize.